I think one of the things that we hear consistently from patients is, is I don't know why I have to tell you this, or why don't you already have access to this information? Of course, we know as healthcare professionals that there are lots of existing barriers to getting the information that you need. It might mean that you're playing phone tennis with a GP practice and, and wasting both your time and theirs to try and get that information quickly. Um, or it might mean that you have access to a local healthcare record, but you don't have the necessary smart card permissions. The patient might be outside of an area that that record sharing solution supports. And so it can still be quite a significant barrier and hurdles that you have to jump through. At Accurex, we developed record view really to allow any healthcare professional to get the information that they need at the point that they need it. And what that means is that in secondary care, in the community and other care settings outside of a GP practice, any healthcare professional that needs to view a patient's GP record can request and view a current and up-to-date summary with explicit permission from the patient. Record view allows you to make safe clinical decisions about patient's care with quick access to current information about patient medications, allergies, investigations, and including things like imaging reports and much, much more. As Accurex, we're in a really privileged position. Because we're used by 98% of GP practices, we can use that network to connect patient records across the NHS, regardless of kind of region or where there's a need for a patient portal, for example. We can provide a method of bringing the record summary to healthcare professionals that cuts out all of the admin work um, of going back and forth, while at the same time retaining a really clear audit trail of who's requested that information, when they've requested it, whether or not permission has been given. The principle that Record Review is built on is our patient permission model. And the reason for that is not just to ensure that access can be granted at point of care um, with the patient in front of you, but also because we want to empower patients to know when and why their medical data is being accessed, empower them to grant information to their clinician, and again, help them to engage with their own care and, and those professionals who are providing direct care for them.